Hey, this is a uh, bocce ball cleaning exercise here. We have some really scuffed up bocce balls. Been playing with these guys for about a year now. Just uh, taking a beating out on the courts. And I'm gonna clean them up. And I'm gonna use a vibrating sander with a really fine grit sandpaper on this. I don't know what it started at when it was warm, but it's probably down to about 180, 200 grit by now. Um, and I'm gonna just basically set the thing in my lap. It's got about a little four inch by four inch pad on it, which is just enough for a bocce ball. Turn it on, and then when I roll the bocce ball on top of the sander, I'm not putting any pressure on it at all, and I'm using my left hand to keep it going in one direction and my right hand to keep it going in the other direction. So it doesn't create a pattern on the ball, and it gets even rotation and all around it, and then I'll spot touch it afterwards. So here we go. Let's try it out and see what we got. After about only 30 more seconds, these, this bocce ball is pretty clean, so that really took less than two minutes. Um, and now I'm just going to spot touch it very lightly in a few places, um, just to get some of the remaining scuffs off. And the trick is to not really put any pressure on it, because you want to keep the thing spher spherical. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Again, without putting any pressure on it or without spending too long in any one place, right? Um, we've got this bocce ball really nice and clean compared to what it was. I'm not a perfectionist, so I'm going to leave this as is. I feel really good about what we've accomplished here in just a few minutes with this nice bocce ball. I'm going to continue and finish the rest of my set. All right, thanks for watching.